Okay, so the lighting is really bad in here, but we're about to get in the car and I was gonna do the intro then. But I wanted to show you guys my outfit while I still have the chance. So here it is. This little shirt is from, honestly, I think like Ross, maybe TJ Maxx, and I just cut the neck out. And then I'm wearing this little matching set from Airy underneath with my new Adidas. These are the Spezials. The exact ones are linked to my LTK because they're not on the Adidas website. Let's go get coffee and go to the movies. Grab the movie bag. I'm gonna get a blanket and my water bottle and put it in here. Okay, JK, since it's 40X, I'm gonna bring this with me, but all I'm gonna bring into the actual theater is my blanket. Anyway, I don't think I clarified, but we're going to see Twisters in 40X, and you're like, why are you going at 9 a.m.? Because today is the day that Deadpool and Wolverine comes out, and we're going to see that, but the second that starts playing, they replace Twisters in 40X, and it doesn't look like it's gonna come back, or like we don't know if it's gonna come back. We really want to go see it in 40X because we keep seeing all these videos. But it looks so fun, and what if they don't bring it back and then we miss it? We don't want that to happen. So we're going to go pick up Brenna and go get coffee first and breakfast, and then we're going to go to the theater. Yay! If you know me, you know I love, like, roller coasters and stuff, and this is, like, Twisters is such a good movie for 40X, I feel like, so I'm so excited. I've never seen anything in 40X before. Okay. I knew you were like in the shadows. <laughs> we're at the movie theater where we just filmed the like first part of a TikTok. We're doing the like, this is us before Twisters in 40X and then we're gonna come in after and do this is us after. I don't know what it's like, I just don't know what to expect. Like I know it's gonna be crazy, but like, I don't know like what we're gonna look like after. I think we're gonna be a little scared at first. We got our coffee. How would you rate your coffee today? Let's go. Oh, one 10 out of 10. 10. I already, 10 out of 10. It's already gone. I already ate my muffin. We're gonna go into the theater. So, I'll update you guys, but on my phone, because I'm not bringing my camera in, because it says don't bring valuables in if you can't secure them. Yeah. <laughs> so we're just gonna go with the phone and cross our fingers. This movie, so theater, this movie theater's popping for 9 a.m. Mm -hmm. on a Thursday. They're all here for this. They're all yeah, here they're for all twisters. They're all here for twisters. The Glenn effect. Oh okay. up our makeup because after we saw twisters we committed to this video i think i i probably already put it but we kind of ruined our makeup or our mascara so now we're just redoing it a little bit before we go see deadpool and we just watched a video on youtube with my mom like recapping everything that you need to know for deadpool and wolverine and i always like think of things to say and then forget them when i actually hit record our first 40x experience oh basically all we did when we got back was sit on the couch i finished editing another video oh i made like the thumbnail for it and i set it to upload and we played just to impress for a couple hours we watched set it up because we were on like a glenn powell streak what a day filled Ooh. with finding mm -hmm. <laughs> now it's like four o'clock so we're just redoing our makeup a little bit and then we're gonna leave we might stop and get like a snack or dinner or something to take into the movie with us. But yeah, first 40X experience. I think that they should have been more aggressive. Personally, I think that the water should have been more. Like they, they didn't utilize the water. There's like mascara under my eyes. And there's like just smoke coming out of the front and like It should have been all machine. around. Yeah. Or it should have been like from the two front corners and like a lot. Because mm -hmm. then by the time like it gets out of like one little bubble that the fog is in. Can I use one of your blush brushes? Mm hmm. What, like, what kind? It doesn't matter, just the one I've been playing with. Well, my shadow, but I use this blush. <laughs> guys 
it's like two days since I last talked to you pretty much basically what happened is the day they went to see the movies I was having like really bad stomach pains and the next morning me and my mom went to urgent care to try and figure out what was wrong and luckily I'm not dying so <laughs> But I still haven't been feeling very good, so yesterday I pretty much just chilled out all day and I didn't really do anything, so I didn't film. And then today, um, we went and saw Deadpool and Wolverine again. I, guys, don't ask me how many times I've been to the movie this week. But basically my dad w ended up having to go out of town last minute, I think, before Deadpool and Wolverine came out. And we go and see it on like the Thursdays, like a day early. And we always go see it as a family because marvel's like a family thing but since he was out of town me and my mom didn't want to wait to go see it because we didn't want to see like any spoilers we're really excited about it so then today now my dad's home we went and saw it again with him because we weren't going to make him go by himself obviously but just as good the second time loved it so much i'm just chilling in bed now i made some tiktoks and posted those because i didn't want to be like too far behind i'm not feeling as bad as i was the other day so i'll take it but Deadpool and Wolverine was so, so good. The cameos, oh my gosh, like I'm not going to say too much. I don't want to spoil anything for any of you guys that haven't seen it yet. But the cameos were so good. All of the little, like, hints and Easter eggs for things in the future I'm so excited about. And I'm just going to pretty much chill the rest of today. I originally was going to make this a weekend in my life. But now with me kind of being um, out of service for two days, I'm probably just going to make it a couple days in my life. And it'll go into the next week a little bit. Okay, my hair is all over the place, but so it's the next day. Basically, yesterday I didn't really do anything else. I'm feeling even better today. And Hayden is coming over and she's going to spend the night. So I'm excited about that. I woke up at like 9.30 and then ate breakfast and watched the Olympics with my mom. We watched the gymnastics and then some of the like skateboarding. And then I just made lunch, took a shower to wash my hair real quick. Hayden said she's gonna leave. I need to pick up jewelry for the day because this is not gonna work. We're pretty much just gonna chill, like we're not gonna go do anything. Doesn't matter too much. I literally just wanted like a little touch. And once I'm done with this, I need to put away some laundry. I'm feeling a lot better today. I'm trying to drink a lot of water. I already like pretty much tidied up my room, so I have a pile of laundry on my bed right there and then I have some more laundry in the laundry room so that is what I'm gonna do next and I might put on a YouTube video or something so here she's joined the party can you guess what we're gonna do this sleepover you're like oh my god you're gonna like go out and like party and stuff right because you're <laughs> teenagers <laughs> no you're probably not thinking that we're just gonna play roblox and get boba and get boba we're wow. literally just gonna go get boba we're gonna go to the gas station get funyuns and then we're gonna come back and our typical go-to is playing roblox and eating funyuns and watching supernatural lately we've been playing dress to impress but we might play some horror games this time too because we like those <laughs> hey guys update so hold on i'm closing my blinds we went and got boba and we drank it and it was really good and then we ate funyuns and peanut m ms and then we played Roblox for a little bit before we stopped and watched like four episodes of Supernatural because Hayden doesn't have Netflix right now so she can only watch it at my house. But I've been making her watch it and she's on season three now officially. We just watched season three episode two. And then I played Roblox with some of you guys. I created like a private server on Dress to Impress and put up my Instagram story. So if you don't follow me on Instagram and you want to play Roblox with me sometime, make sure you follow it. I'll put it on the screen but it'll also be linked in my description and it was really fun we played like eight rounds probably we played we played a lot it was really fun i'll put some pictures on the screen but i posted like a picture of me and my friend playing roblox once and one of you guys said that i should let you guys play with me and i was like that's a great idea so that's what we did um and we just got off and said bye and now we're gonna go make ourselves some food <gasps> <laughs> we're making dinner we're making ramen i'm making ramen correction actually girl you're taking videos of me 
I'm making my world famous ramen sauce. I make like stir fry ramen. I'm just saying, all my friends always ask me to make it, so it must be pretty good. There's two spoons in there because Hayden was trying it too. Alexis, I'm trying to She's this. very good at making it. Here is the ramen in all her glory. Ooh. Honestly, not my best sauce work, but still pretty good. What would you rate it? From prior sauces? Yeah. 8.5. 8.5. I think that's a solid answer. Good morning. Hi. So I have a hair appointment for Friday, so it's okay. I, guys, I just want to lay in my bed. I don't want to make videos, but it's okay. I don't know. I'm just like not in a creative mood right now. Happens to the best of us. Okay, genuinely don't know what my hair is doing or what I'm going to do with my hair. But I finished getting ready. Sorry for the lack of enthusiasm. I'm just like, I don't want to make TikToks. I don't know why. Sitting on the floor. I just finished filming three TikToks, but two of them were kind of time consuming. Well, actually, all three of them were kind of time consuming today. So, my For You page has been so frustrating. I don't know if like anyone else experiences this. I feel like it's more like a creator problem, but I literally have been scrolling the past like three days, like every chance I get just like scrolling on TikTok to try and find videos to make, and I literally cannot find a single video to make. It's so frustrating. And like, not every trend obviously is going to fit my niche. But for the most part, I can make them my niche. It's just, like, literally nothing is... Like, it's nice to just have, like, if I'm posting, like, two, like, really thought-out edited videos in a day, the other couple videos to be just, like, something that, like, I just put text on or I don't put a whole lot of work into because it can be very time-consuming. But I'm not getting that option right now. Anyway, I'm editing a bookshelf tour. <laughs> Then I'm doing one last watch through of the bookshelf tour and then the videos for today are ready to go and I'm gonna go work on some other stuff because posting time lately hasn't been until later so now you guys are being sniffed. Why are you giving me side eye? <laughs> Currently I have this like stack of books right here but these kind of need to be sorted and put away so we're gonna do that real quick. Carrying that was my workout for the day. Okay, these are gonna fall off my head. Hi. I'm aware this is crooked, but these are the other four books, so I'm gonna put them away real quick. She's flipping all of my stickers on my laptop because I put them on upside down. It seemed fine at the time, but now we're fixing it and I have a new one to put on, so yay. I'll let you do that so you can make sure it's not crooked. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Now, they're the right way! Yay! <laughs> okay, so you guys know that they restocked the Folklore, like the original cardigan, for Folklore's birthday. And me and my mom both got one, so we're gonna unbox it together. Okay, let's open her up. I have my little handy dandy. Oh, did I break it? I hope so. I'm so excited! I always get it in the smallest size. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, I could cry. I could cry. I saw people say that there's been letters stitched into the little patch, but mine doesn't have any. She's so pretty. She's so pretty. Oh, I have some random pieces of wool, though. Does that count for anything? It's black. It means reputation is coming. 
I'm just kidding. This is amazing. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy right now. You guys don't understand how long I've been wanting this cardigan for. The stars. Made homemade poke bowls and she got so good. Look how delicious she looks. Hey guys, we're making overnight oats together. I did some reading and I did a face mask and it was really great. And now we're gonna make some overnight oats for breakfast in the morning. I I make them myself. I know you can buy like the pre-made stuff, but I kind of want to try that. But today we're making them ourselves. So first thing we're gonna do is a third a cup of oats. These are the quick oats. I think these are like the Target ones. And this isn't the container I normally use. The one I normally use is a little bit cuter, but it's dirty. And this recipe isn't mine. I got it from someone on TikTok. I think her name is Mia. I'll put it on the screen somewhere, but I use it all the time. It's so good. And then I think she does more chia seeds. I only do like a tablespoon. Yeah, I probably do like a half a tablespoon. And then I add my protein powder. I definitely would recommend chocolate, but I don't have chocolate currently. And I wanted to like prove to myself that I was going to eat these overnight oats a lot before I bought chocolate because I don't use chocolate in my smoothies. So I just use vanilla for the protein. I'm gonna do just like almost a scoop today. Some peanut butter protein powder. So it's gonna be more of like a chocolate peanut butter vibe. And then to give mine more chocolatey flavor because I think that tastes better and the vanilla flavor isn't that strong. I do cocoa powder. I probably do about a tablespoon. And then I'm gonna mix that all together. And then I'm like really weird about my yogurt. This might just be like a me thing, but I'm so like picky about it. But I add Greek yogurt for extra protein and it literally like doesn't change the flavor of the texture at all. So don't be, don't be scared. Mix that together and then be back. And then I'll show you guys how I like actually put it together in the morning. Almond milk. And I don't measure it. I just kind of go until I like what texture it is. Okay, here she is. Can't like. This is what it looks like. It smells so good. I'm just gonna put the lid on and put it in the fridge. And I don't know if I'll talk to you guys again tonight because my camera's about to die. And I think I'm like pretty much just gonna go to bed. So I will talk to you guys in the morning. <laughs> It is officially Tuesday. <gasps> Good morning! Good morning! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Good morning! I have a good nice rest! Yeah! Oh my goodness! <laughs> that is how I'm greeted by Maisie every morning. Anyway, we woke up today, did a walk. I walked two miles and then we did abs and I stretched. Oh, there's a freaking bug. Anyway, then we did abs and then I stretched. Well, that is all done. I'm now back in a sweatshirt and my pajama shorts because it's not quite time to get dressed for the day yet. It's currently 8.38, so we made pretty good time. Now I'm ready for breakfast. My stomach is growling. I washed my face, brushed my teeth, all that jazz. Don't have too much going on today. Pretty much the same as yesterday, except for I am being a guest on a podcast today, so that's exciting. By the time this video comes out, I don't think it, my episode will be out yet, but if it is, or even if it isn't, I'll put the name of the podcast on the screen and you guys can go check it out and wait for when my episode does come out. I feel like I'm starting today in a much better mood. Not that like, I was in a good mood yesterday, just like in the middle of the day I crashed for some reason. So I'm trying to decide, do I want like a Celsius? Or do I want a cup of coffee? I kind of want a Celsius, I think. That's so how these turn out. If you're doing chocolate, I recommend strawberries and chocolate chips. I think it's so good. Okay, here is the overnight oat. Now I'm gonna eat this and I may watch YouTube and I'm gonna work on 
making sure my day is planned out. Okay, so I'm about to do my makeup and get ready for the day. We ate breakfast, we planned the day. And next step is doing my makeup. So I'm gonna talk to Snapchat and just kind of like, I haven't been really active on Snapchat, which by the way, if you don't follow me on Snapchat, you should do that. I'll put it in the description. Username is addison.brian. I have been like posting a lot more on Snapchat and honestly, it's been so much fun. I feel like we have our own like little community on Snapchat with you guys. So if you wanna join, if you wanna be one of the cool kids, you should do that and follow me there. But I'm gonna go just kind of update on on, like where I've been what I've been doing because I haven't been posted on there because I've been vlogging and it's like when I'm vlogging something specific I can still do snapchat but when I'm vlogging days in my life that's pretty much what I do on snapchat so it's hard to kind of do it twice if that makes sense hey guys update so I unboxed stuff from my p.o box I'll kind of show you guys in a minute or later today and me and my mom are watching gymnastics at the olympics right now it's the team finals we got Sabrina Carpenter tickets literally they sent out more codes today I guess they like took tickets back from scammers and then they sent out new codes for people and we didn't get one but someone we knew got an extra one and they gave it to us and we managed to get three tickets so, so it's good because we planned an entire trip around this concert so we really needed those tickets i've gotten everything on my to-do list for before lunch done so now i need to eat lunch and then i'm going to start editing this video then i have that podcast at 1 30 so like actually i probably won't have time to start editing that video but i have lunch and then i'm going to go over like the questions and stuff for the podcast food tell me why that wasn't recording <laughs> plot twist of addy's life i'm doing courses because i'm going to be assistant cheer coaching at a school near me but i'm doing a heat illness prevention course right now i have to do four courses this one is currently telling me the dangers of energy drinks while i'm drinking a celsius <laughs> So it keeps saying like the word acclimatization and acclimatize and it's just like I can't stop doing that you, you guys know the video I'm talking about like the partial acclimatize Partial acclimatize double acclimatize no acclimatize I just imported all the clips so far onto my laptop so I can start editing those this evening And then now I'm working on making this little TikTok that kind of requires me to like be creative I have to like use some, some editing skills here and me and my mom have been working on a draft like a script for a brand deal that i have going coming up which i'm so so excited about because it's with a brand that i actually really really love and use i literally used it this morning so it's her snapchat too which is exciting because i've been working really hard on growing my snapchat so snapchat friends you're a real one and i'm so excited i'm gonna work on posting for the day okay so we're going to my room i'm gonna change i'm already wearing sweatpants but i'm gonna like actually put on like a cute comfy outfit and we're gonna work on editing this video I posted on TikTok, I reposted the videos to Instagram and Snapchat, so I'm feeling very accomplished right now. I posted four times, pretty good for me. I've been really struggling to find videos to make the last few days. I think I might have mentioned that in this vlog. Like, I've been struggling so hard, and I finally found a couple today. Like, this morning I woke up, there was no videos, and then, like, right before I filmed videos, I scrolled for, like, a minute, and I found, like, three, and I was like, yes, thank you. I changed, I'm wearing pajama pants now. PO unboxing. I'm not gonna go through like everything because a lot of them were just letters. But, like I'm not gonna read them to you guys. So someone sent this little friendship bracelet and it's so cute and I like that it's adjustable. And then this one actually fits me perfectly and it says A B on it and it's so cute. And then someone also sent a little ring. Also, I just want to like say while we're here, I'm kind of happy with how this week turned out because it kind of started really slow, not being productive, you know, being sick and not feeling good. And then it transitioned into me like getting my life back on track, being productive. Today I got so much done. So I just like, I want to show you guys like all the days, not just the days where I'm super productive or I'm doing everything I need to do. But, like everyone has off days. There are days when I'm not productive. There are days when I'm sick. Like, I will never cut out something because just because it's not exactly what I want it to be because I want to be real with you guys that like this is my life. Sometimes it goes the way I want it to, sometimes it doesn't, sometimes I have random stomach problems, like I'm human, I'm not perfect. Just putting that out there, it's okay to have off days, it's okay to not feel good, it's okay to not be productive. <laughs> FaceTime with Brenna and we're trying to pick what nails I'm gonna get tomorrow. I found these ones that were really cute. A little starfish on them. Something like that I feel like could be cute. I think I figured out what nails I'm gonna get tomorrow. My mom made dinner. We've got protein mac and cheese, some broccoli that I put some seasoning on, and then some fake chicken tenders. And I just know it's about to be so good so I'm gonna watch The Rookie for a little bit while I eat. I just changed into a little 
walking outfit. Me and my mom are gonna go on another walk this evening because like I said, I was having stomach problems. So I'm trying to walk as much as possible to help with digestion. And I'm gonna listen to my audiobook while I go, which right now I'm listening to Woke Up Like This. It has like a purple cover and like balloons. I don't know, but I'm not sure how I feel about it yet, so. So I did this whole process to print out a label for a giveaway I was shipping and then what else have I done? I planned out my day tomorrow and sat and talked with my mom for a little bit She made these like protein balls that I'm really excited about and I'm gonna eat in the morning And now it's like 9 10. I think I'm gonna do some under eye patches and we're gonna read for a little bit My masks are on they're kind of sliding down my face, but we're going with it I'm gonna turn on my YouTube ambiance and we're gonna do some reading and made my bed and now I'm dressed. We're gonna leave pretty soon. I'm gonna wear my Sambas. Hey guys, I didn't end up making breakfast. I just put my shoes in and did my makeup. Now I'm gonna grab a little snack. Guys, we have this problem where we keep wearing the same freaking outfits. Look, okay, this is what I decided to wear today. These like relaxed shorts, concert tee, and Adidas with longer socks, right? Concert tee, relaxed shorts, Adidas with longer socks. What? my shoes i'll show you which ones i got when we get home but now we're at the nail salon we're gonna go get coffee at this place next to the nail salon first because it's such good coffee and i decided on my nails i think i'm gonna do like a baby pink with chrome i wanted to do some kind of chrome but my mom said that the pink was the most summery option both did different shades of pink with the chrome i ended up going for a brighter pink because they didn't have the one i originally wanted but i think it worked out because i actually think this is like still really fun and summery it's so cute so now we're gonna go back to sephora so i can get eyebrow gel and then we're gonna go to plato's closet to drop off some clothes and then we're gonna go waste time at target while we wait for the clothes to be done which is scary. Which is scary. But we're not allowed, we put ourselves on a book buying ban while we were in the nail salon. So neither of us are allowed to buy a book until we read five books off of our physical TBR. So it's gonna be really hard. I'm doing a quick little haul before I make lunch. So first, Dix, my shoes. I'm so excited. We're gonna go on a walk, another walk this evening so that I can wear them and test them out. But I got the Hoka Clifton Nines in this color. They're like basically just a plain white, but I liked this one more than the plain white because it's kind of got like grays mixed in, so it's it's a little bit more dimensional. I'm so excited about them. I've never really had like nice tennis shoes like that. Sephora, I did finally get an eyebrow gel. Those of you who follow me on Snap, you guys know what a dilemma this has been. But I got the Rare Beauty eyebrow gel. I heard someone talk about it on TikTok and I was like, okay, I will give it a shot. Then Target, I got quite a couple things. Well, first I got conditioner because I ran out and they didn't have, I normally use a hair mask and they didn't have the one I use. So I'm trying this new brand. It's the Salt Air one and we will see. It says it's supposed to be really hydrating, which is good for my hair, obviously. Then I've been really wanting a pair of ballet flats because I feel like styled the right way, they could be so cute and I just like haven't invested in them yet. I found these in the Target Kids section. They're just plain black ones and they also had this really cute pair of red ones that had a little bit of a heel and I'm obsessed with them, but I think I wanna see how I feel about these. I think I'll be able to style these with more and if I like them, I might go back and get the red ones for New York because I'm going to New York my birthday if you guys didn't know then i found these little shorts like they were made for me guys they have little cherries we all know how i feel about cherries i love them so much and you can also wear them like rolled down like this i think they could be honestly really cute styled and as pajamas so they're multi-use it's like really cheap satin pajamas because this is what i got when i first got into pajama sets and these are honestly like they're just not good they're falling apart so 
I've really been wanting to just replace them and I finally did today I was like I just need to do it so that's what I got mainly for everything else um I got some ankle socks too because I wanted some that didn't have Nike on it mine are just all kind of dingy looking and the Nike symbols are like coming out of them so I don't think that's normal I'm gonna throw these away because I got these replacements first one I found in the kids section but it was so cute and they had it in a large which I feel like should fit me they had an extra large too so if it doesn't i can go back and exchange it but the large looks like it should fit me and it's got these little like stripes on it and they're green and pink and like cream and i feel like they're so cute i just i love them i feel like they have personality then i got this shirt it's on sale it's like a light blue and it has little seashells and last thing i wanted this is the pajamas that i was originally going for but then i saw this other one and i was like my mom she enables me. She was like, well, you're going to wear them both. And if you get rid of all of your satin ones, then you should just get both because the kids ones are obviously cheaper because they're kids. So then I got this just plain gray and I love this material. I feel like putting this on after wearing those satin ones for so long is going to be life changing. But that is everything. So that is my haul for today. I also wanted to show you guys, we found Barbie Olipops that look so good. And so we put those in the freezer so we could have them with our lunch for making sandwiches. Sandwich. Goldfish crisps and Pringles. Okay, here's the Olipops. They're so cute. Look at them. Mm. That's delicious. I taste the peach. That's so good. Adorable, too. I don't know if this is limited edition or not, but if it is, we're going to need to go buy some. My hair is like so slicked back on the top right now. Please ignore it. But I'm editing this video and I've gotten everything done, like rough edit, up until yesterday at lunch. So I'm going to take the SD card out of this camera and import everything else and then I'm gonna snack on some goldfish crisps because these are so good while I do it. What are you doing? It's people watching o'clock, I guess. They're both in here. So I, last time I talked to you, I was editing a YouTube video. I ended up, I filmed videos before that, I forgot to mention, and I posted for the day and all of that jazz. I'm pretty much done with the YouTube video. I have like, a little bit left to do but the like most of the hard work is done i'm about to oh also i tested out my shoes we went on a walk i walked a mile with the family and we took the dogs with us so that was good and then now i'm about to there's a train going by i'm about to do video to watch while i do my nighttime routine and i'm gonna put on one of my new cute pajama sets so i'll come back once i've done that <laughs> okay i'm in my little matching pajama set it's so comfy and i love it so much and i'm about to go to bed so that concludes this video Thank you so much for hanging out with me this past week and going on this little roller coaster that has been this past week. I will see you guys next Thursday. You can't tell I'm uploading on Thursdays now, so stay tuned. Anyway, I love you guys. Thank you so much for following me to YouTube and watching my videos. I'm so glad that you guys are loving them so much. As usual, if you have any suggestions on video ideas or anything you want to see me upload here, please leave it in the comments and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys next time. Bye!